Hello and welcome. So typically I come in here and I just say, you know, the name of the game and, and who makes it and all of that. But I want to start off by saying that I've played a lot of city builders. I've played uh, city builders, colony builders, whatever you want to call them. I've played a lot of them. And uh, this complex sky thing here is uh, is something different. Uh, you know, you go through the sort of the, the way you play the game. You put some housing down, you put some uh, factories down or some sort of commercial buildings. You know the system. This one takes all of that and uh, it really changes some things up. So I thought we should check it out here. It's over on itch.io. It is free. It's in development. I'll put links down below. It's free games month after all. So we're going to try one out and see if uh, I'll do my best to explain what's going on. But there's really a lot happening here. And it's not that it's complicated. It's just different. So first off, we have to choose our town. And this won't make any sense to start with. But basically, they're just bonuses. Uh, bonuses and but negatives for each town. We've got uh, Wopush, Lorikia, and Vadast. I suppose I should also say that this is a city builder, but it's a uh, we're like building a city in the sky. And we can go up, we can build down, we can build uh, over. That, that's not anything new. But we, yeah, we can go up in the sky and down. It's kind of fancy. Um, so what are we going to pick? I don't really know. I think I'm just going to pick the one that has the coolest name. Vadast seems all right. It has a pollution cleaning rate, which isn't that hard to deal with. So maybe we'll pick... Reduce maintenance credits, assembly specialized, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, more population space. Lorikia sounds great. As for my master, we need a master scientist or a master of architecture. Sure, that sounds like a great thing we do. We can change all kinds of things, but I'm not going to touch it because uh, I don't really know what it does. So uh, let's build ourselves a world here, a world floating in space. And our town is there as well. And we're going to build up this thing. All right, welcome to Lorikia in the alpha version of Complex Sky. Uh, there is a, uh, a Steam page, I think, for this game as well. I'll put links in the description if there is. Um, all right, so uh, many unique... Uh, yeah, there, there you go. It says it right there. I could have said all... I could I should have just shown you the screen and not said a word, but things are different. All right, so we have one building at the moment. We have an operations center. And this essentially is the thing that makes... Uh, it's basically just a big warehouse is what it is. So we're going to start this thing off with a, a quest here. We've got a, a quest over here to go build a house. That's job number one. Okay, we can figure that out. So uh, we are not only are we floating in, in space, but we can go up and down. We've got floating cars on roads. And uh, if we wish, we can go underneath the town. We got these little floaty guys. Let me flip that back over there. We got these little floaty guys underneath here, which is what's keeping the, the town afloat. So wait is a thing as well. There's a capacitor bridge over there. Uh, all around us we got land, and, and at this land we'll grab resources from it to build our town. Uh, each of these buildings can have upgrades on them. They'll get new modules that get grown onto them as well, so rather than just building 50 houses, you'll build like one house, one or two houses, and then you'll just sort of build onto it, making it a big place. But to start with, we gotta go build, uh, go get some iron and stuff. So we will grab some iron and stuff and uh, and some coal and all that. Uh, at the moment, we are going to manually click this stuff and grab it. But uh, we'll get automated things. Miners and, and um, uh, well, miners is it. But we'll build a mining station, which has little offshoot things that goes and does all the mining. Uh, we also are going to go and get uh, transports going and, and hauling this stuff all around. So I can just sort of sit back and uh, and be a bit lazy, I guess. Grab all that. Uh, you can see things are getting moved in down here, and as it comes in, again, another thing that can be automated in time, but right now is not so automated, is making uh, things. It's making this iron and just flatten it out in some iron plates. We can take these rocks and smush them into some slabs, uh, and that, there you go. So uh, we have a world inventory. We also have an inventory here in our operations center, which we'll keep an eye on. I'm going to try to not overwhelm you because lots of weird things going on. First job, though, build a house. Let's do that. So uh, let's go and go to the city structure. We only have one thing so far. Lots of things will, will appear in time. But this basic apartment is the thing we can make. Now, this thing is going to cost me 2,000 credits. It has a weight limit of 90, which we'll see eventually. Uh, it also takes up a main control capacity, which is another thing that's just sort of out there. We'll cover eventually. Uh, it also takes 25 of those metal things and some wood. So make this guy. But this guy has to have some sort of foundation to be built on so let's put a foundation down shall we uh we're gonna put this house like right right over here seems nice so let's go and do that so now we've got this sort of frame set up 
Uh, but it still can't go on the frame. It has to be built on a actual foundation. So we have to go back in here and put a foundation down. Like that. Okay, so now, 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 we can build a house. Now you can see there's some some uh, some pointy things that are some glowing things. We got yellow, blue, and, and white. The white one is the road connection. The yellow and blue is our electrical connections, which we'll see uh, in time something happening. We've unlocked technology. All right, so we can go grab lots of different techs here that we'll eventually grab. Most of this is like automated things. Uh, at the start of the game, it's all like free grabs. We can grab, you know, as long as we've got money, we can take it. So we'll grab utility services, which is water and power. Uh, we've got a, um, I, won't, I won't overwhelm yet. We'll just stuck with power and water right now. Look at these floaty little trucks flying around. Uh, let's take a look at our house. So we can see this here. Also, the house wants power. House wants water. Uh, there is 10 people living here at the moment. We'll choose what they can consume, which will make them happy. Uh, we've got different storage, which each building can have a different storage amount. They'll want rice or something to keep them happy. Uh, we could transport things uh, to and from. The game kind of automates that for us if we wish. We've got trash, disp trash dispensers and canteens we can upgrade with to make this house fancier. We can upgrade it with modular worker houses, which like builds up and down and around and, and makes this one little house into something very fancy. So, um, before I overwhelm too much, let's go get ourselves some utilities. Put down a water pipe. Uh, now, the water pipe has to go to that. See that gray square there? It has to go to that. And we're basically building this underneath. Or actually, I guess we're building it at like the, the road level is where these pipes are going in. So, we're just going to pop this guy in like right there. There we go. He's got water, and we're going to give him some, pay, uh, some power, and uh, there we go. So this guy has some, but uh, we're, we're distributing it that way. We're going to need to get some power making here in a second. Uh, quest complete. Done. 5,000 bucks. Excellent. Okay, there's power and water. Go build a... Um... Oh, oh, I did it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, research. I need to learn basic research. Okay, I'll do that in a second, and I need to go in uh, and do what? Artificial ecosystem. Got it. Got it. So, uh, yeah, we can get to where we can, like, put, like, trees on top of, like, rooftop trees. It's very exciting. Anyway, power is a thing. So let's go back to that research menu, which was up here. And I'm going to go ahead and grab what I can at the moment, which is basic farming, which is going to allow me to get uh, rice farms and floating land, which is, like, that stuff out there. Uh, it'll also make um, saplings, which we'll see here. We need to take, we need money, we need dirt, which I grabbed when I was grabbing those trees earlier. So we'll take that one. Um... And we'll take iron processing, which is a building which does what I did before, where I manually made those... I smashed that iron out into some sheets. This one does it for me. So we'll uh, we'll, we'll take that also. Oh, oh, never mind. What do I need? I need... Oh, I need more iron. Okay. All right. So let's go and uh, and get... Is that what I wanted? More iron? Uh, this was this one. Oh, I needed 20, I think is what it said. Maybe. Uh, let me go back to the mining button and go uh, get some mining stuff done. Where was that iron at? Is that it? Yeah, we'll grab some of that. I should make them very happy. And we'll get that brought in. So, uh, it's it's very incremental. Things will sort of start, you know, start cranking up here in, in a bit. But right now, it's pretty basic. Nothing a whole lot going on. Uh, power and water is depleting. Those red numbers up there, that's what it's yelling me about. Um, and uh, we're going to need to get a, 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 uh, a the ability to making a utility service here to do that. So, just like the house, it's going to have to have a foundation to build on. Now, there's little things that... There's, like, little perks in there. There's a tutorial, by the way. And uh, it's it's uh, it's a little rough. Um, and it kind of skips some steps around here and there. And so it's a little bit, you know, difficult to follow. But um, through trial and error. And not everything is also said, either. So, like, building a factory next to a house gives you, like, more space or something. There's all kinds of little things that kind of work together that you, I guess, have to just sort of find. But I'm going to go build myself a electricity spot. Which is going to go, I guess, right here. I think it's a 2 by 2 if I remember right. Are you a 2x2? Two two? You are! Okay, so he has to go on a foundation as well. So we'll pop him in right there. Uh, if we click on it, it shows me things as well. Um, the uh, He cost me 20 grand. He's kind of heavy. These uh, gears and those, uh, those, those square things are already here in this place. Which I can grab if I want to put into my into my world inventory. I can pop them in there as I, as I choose. Um, we'll see more of this in a minute. But you have a world inventory, and you have, like, a city inventory. Um, but that that's just kind of confusing, so we won't talk about that. Let's go and put this guy right there. Okay, so he'll make water and power once he gets a, uh, a fuel source, which is going to be um, coal. There we go. So we'll give him some coal. 
Uh, I think I have to put that coal into here. So what I was just showing you there. I'm going to go pop my coal into this guy. All 25 of them. Can you get over there, buddy? Uh, hey, hey, coal. You want to get over there? There you go. Okay. So coal can go over there. Now the coal will make its way over here eventually. Uh, I also need to get these utilities set up. So let's get a water pipe. Uh, there. And a power line. There. Water power. Okay, good. So now it's going to feed stuff out there. And we should start getting some good numbers here as soon as that, uh, that makes its way over here. Now, transport. Let's talk about this. So this is a big part of the game. Well, it's sort of a big part. I guess it can be a big part of the game. Um, you can go and manually, like, set what goes where and how much goes and all that. As far as, like, coal going from this building into here. Going from my mining place into this building and then into here to, to power the thing. Or you can just push the button that says auto. Um, which I don't have. <laughs> uh, so I guess it's happening. I guess it's happening as it is. I guess it auto happens. Okay. This... <laughs> Bad example. This one does actually doesn't have the button for auto sort. Uh, oh, all right. This one does. Auto setup transport. There you go. So, uh, for instance, we can do that with, like, our rice fields and all that. So we've got electricity. We've got water. Uh, what's the next quest? Research. Done, right? Oh, no, no, not yet. Uh, about you. No, no. I, rather, I need basic research. Can I do that yet? Um, oh, did we hit? I hit the wrong button. Uh, oh, oh, I got go, get out of here. Uh, go back to my farming thing, or tech thing. I do want to get this iron processing done, so let's go ahead and grab that. And I want to go ahead and get, this is what it wants me to get, is basic research. I think it's, is it after this point? Uh, it's right here at, it's after mining, I think. When you start seeing this little uh, gear in here. So we just have to build a research lab, and we start, you know, taking time to to, to learn things. It, take, it takes basically a resource to make stuff. So, it wants me to get basic research. It costs me some of these stone cloaks, which we'll have to make. Uh, the artificial ecosystem takes saplings and dirt, which I think I picked up already. I didn't. What do I need? I need, uh, I need ten saplings. Alright. Well, uh, I can do this the, uh, the easy way, which is like, um, not like this. Alright, alright. Never mind. No easy way. Let me go build myself a, a farm. So, we're gonna put this guy, I think it's a... Th Two by three. Am I correct about this? Um, rice farm, yeah, yeah. So we pop him in over here. He needs to be on a foundation as well. Um, I think it's this one. So we'll give him a foundation. Next to this house over here. And we will pop in a, uh, a rice farm. Right there. Okay, so we got a farm going in here. This guy is uh, is going to do a couple different things. Uh, he needs water first off, so we'll deal with that, that problem. Which, again, we're just going to connect it up here. And... There. There it goes. Okay, so water has been brought to here. He's going to need some things to make stuff. So we should tell him what to do, basically. Um, we can say, uh, he's got three options. Three things he can make. He can make rice, he can make saplings, and then another thing. So, if you want to make rice, it, uh, it, it not only makes rice, it takes water. It also clears up pollution, which is a thing we may have a problem with in time. There's numbers everywhere. Numbers everywhere on this game. So if you wanted to look at some numbers, they're all over the place. I will try not to cover them. So uh, we'll get some rice brought in, and we want to get some saplings. Remember, that's part of our quest. So we need dirt, water, and pollution cleanup to bring in some saplings. Um, the uh, the dirt is missing because it doesn't have a transport set up. So I could say, hey, go over here, pick up the dirt, come back. But we're just going to say that. And it'll do it all for us right there. I should have shown you this before. It was empty before. There was nothing here. I'll clear it all out. And then I hit auto setup, and it does it all for me. So it's bringing uh, rice to this main place. It's taking see it, saplings to that main place, and it's bringing in dirt. And once it hits 80 dirt, it'll bring it in. So this guy, once he gets 80 dirt, he will uh, deliver it. Uh, which he has no dirt, because it's in my pocket. Um, again, we can automate all this stuff, and we will in time. But for right now, I'm just going to toss it into there for him to grab it. Uh, that coal doesn't seem to be going over there, is it? Uh, I wonder if I should bring it over, uh, just bring it over here. Uh, he might be using my wood, actually. It says, it says, it says nothing there. Uh, here, let me just do this. Let me, let me grab this, this coal. Uh, maybe. So, yeah, there's the coal. And then brought, drop it off over here. Just so he, uh, he has something. But you don't want, you don't want the coal? Alright, you know what? Fine. I'll keep the coal. 
Alright, we'll get him up. He probably wants a, wants a production line or something set up. Uh, roads, by the way, are called... Uh, what are they called? They're called... something. Uh, where is it at? They're called Levitate Networks. Because it's the future, you know? Alright, so, uh, our, our, our power is, I mean, it's, I guess it's working, it's going up, so power's doing a thing. Um, we've got, we have a warehouse, we have a food place, we have a, uh, a people place. Uh, this people place we can say, we can add in here, if we add in, uh, a, a rice option for them, deliver rice to these people, it'll make more people come in. So we're going to say, yeah, deliver rice over there, auto set up that transport, and the one car is going to come up from here, he's going to drop off some rice, and then he will be happy. There we go, our, our house is looking better already. So we should have some rice, I think I just saw one. Are you making it yet? Yeah, yeah, he's making it, so it'll get over there eventually. And the saplings are happening as well, so, oh, they're like, they're like on top, F, what's going on over here? Hmm. Those two cars need to get a room. All right, iron processing is done. Uh, this one I can do now because I have saplings and dirt, so I, I think, yes. Artificial ecosystems unlocks trees. So we can make trees now. In the future, we don't know what trees are. We, we do now. All right, so we can go and get some of these basic research, which is to take some stone cloaks now. Are you following now? I, I hope, what's going on? Missing consumption. Uh, what? Are you missing, um, oh, you're missing your, um, you're missing your rice, or, uh, yeah, yeah, or your rice, whatever, is that what you wanted? Oh, can I do this now? Yeah, I'm doing it now. I want to build one now. Uh, I think. Oh, I need to, I need to, I need to research that. Okay, that's what. So, uh, next, next thing on the list. Let's go down the, uh, the old quest log here. So, we're still waiting on that one. I do have trees, though. I guess I gotta get this basic research done first. So, let's go and see if I can do that. Um, I can't make them here, but I've got a building here, the Assembler Foundry, which makes that. So I'm going to pop this guy in. He's going to go right right in over here. If you ever get lost on like what something is, you can go to the building library. These are all I have right now. Things will grow in. Click on this guy, and there you go. You want numbers? This game's got it for you. Plenty of numbers. More numbers than you even thought you knew you wanted. Uh, but this guy will, will produce stone cloaks, uh, which, which is a word that uh, I uh, never knew Went with the word stone until today. Let's go put this guy in. I don't know how big he is, but I'm going to go do something like that. And uh, how big are you? He's two by two. Okay, let's give him a foundation. He's going to go right there. And we're going to put in Mr. Assembly Foundry. Right like that. Okay, so he needs some, you know, usual thing. Electricity, power. Like that. And like that. And then he will be... Oh, he doesn't even need water. Okay, so now, same as like that race farm, we have to tell him to go make something. So we know we need some of those stone cloaks. It takes stone, obviously. Um, and I guess I might as well have him make some iron plates, too, while I'm at it. You know, d you know, just do it. So we're going to go ahead and set up the auto set transport, which will deliver the stuff from the main place to there. And then we'll get it done. Now, one of the techs I'm going to be getting here in a second is mining, which is going to make all this stuff make sense here in a second. Uh, because I'm like delivering goods that I I'd have to manually get, which I should probably go grab real quick just to make sure I've got plenty coming in. Uh, there's more iron over there. Right, mining kill's full, so just bring that stuff in and and have it set up over here so they can deliver the stuff. Um, I don't know if they can grab from my from my inventory. I actually don't know how that works. I haven't paid close enough attention for that. Stone's clearly coming in from, well, from the mining I was just doing. There's a bunch of iron here as well. I'll just go ahead and toss it into this spot because this is, it's going to go out from here. So this will keep things running smoothly. So there we go. All right, so he should be working here in a moment. There you go. Stone and, and iron has moved in. The transports are working. The stuff's getting made. And, uh, and that should allow us to go complete our task of this. Correct? Uh, no, we need 10 stone cloaks. We have them to get made. Uh, and transported is mainly the real the real issue here. Uh, and they, they transport once they get 20. So. so once they make their way over here, we'll be in good shape. And then we can make ourselves... Oh, oh you made one! Wait, you made... You've only had four! You put him over here yet? Yeah, he's just going kind of slow. Just, just give him some time. Um, once he makes them, then... I can't make them on my own, can I? No, I can't do them on my own. I cannot. Okay, 
Uh, so we'll wait for that, and then we'll get the tech done, and then we get some mining done, and then we start automating things, and then everything moves along a lot nicer. So uh, that, that's, I guess, the next task here. Uh, there's all kinds of goodies over here we can grab. I'm, I, while I'm waiting for that, I'm just going to start grabbing some of this iron up. I'll grab some of this uh, wood and dirt. There's I need a bunch of coal, which is going to be the first thing I automate, which is right here, this this dafcinium def, def, stone. Is that a real word? Am I, am I a dumb dumb? Because I never heard that word before. Or is this made up? Like, I've heard of iron ore before. What is this one called? Blue rule? A blue rule forest? Uh, I don't know about that one. Copper? I, I know what that one is. Yeah, well. Whatever blue rule is, we got it. Uh, oh, you know what? I think I know what blue rule is, actually. Um... Or one of these, anyway. So, uh, I mentioned before that we were floating, right? I mean, obviously. And and there is a weight limit. And each of these little turny guys down here are what's are what's making us float. And um, there's a resource for that. There's a resource that's I think it's being used. These lifters here. I haven't got to that point of the game yet, but there's some sort of a mechanism that you have to deal with for that. And I think, I assume, it has to do with that blue stuff. It's got it. It's the only thing I don't I don't understand. So it's that's got to be it. Uh, all right, how how is this stuff working? Are we getting these things yet? What are you doing over here, you slacker? We got sixteen of them. All right, hurry it up. Can't really do anything until we get. He's only making them two at a time. But once he gets the twenty, they'll deliver it, and then we'll be in good shape. And then we'll be set. Uh, this one's done. And once I, once this uh, this research is done, which will unlock the ability to make research labs, this will give us everything else. And that's going to give us the uh, like the um, uh, the bits that's going to allow the, the research stuff. Uh, I just realized this one is unlocked, and I could get the mining tree. I guess I should do that. So this is going to give me a mining... Dr uh, this is going to give me a, a mining facility, which is then able to be had modules on, which will allow mining drills, wood collectors, utility collectors. We'll finally see a building that really gets to get built up. Uh, fancy style. So let's go ahead and grab this thing. This one's done yet. Uh, no, it only needs 10, but they gotta get, get them. Oh, there it is. So, there we go. We got that one done. Uh, tech is, uh, oh, quest is done. Done. Okay, so, let's go forward. Weak science. Uh, okay. I'm not sure what that one is. Uh, I got a rice farm already. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. More house, it says. Okay, I'll do that in a second. Uh, build some trees and get some mining done. So, let's go get some mining done right now. And that's, that's what I'm looking forward to. So, we gotta go and get some ore delivered to Mr. Power Plant. This guy over here. And this is a, this is, that's iron. Where's the, where's the ore at? This one? Yeah, this one. Okay. Um, so, let's get a mine set up. I think I'm just gonna do it right here. So, now we build a mining, a, a mine. And then, attached to the mine, but they can be distant from the mine, is the ability to, uh, the miners. Uh, if that makes any sense. So I think I'd like to do something like let's try this. So we put a uh, the road has to be on this guy. So let's go with something like this. I hope I can make some little scrawny things in there. If I can't, then it will. Uh, and I'm gonna put in a where is it at? There's my research lab. I want to put a mining facility, which is how big? Two by two. So let's get a mining facility set up over here, like um, that. And then it's going to need some foundation. Again, this stuff weighs stuff, so you got to be kind of careful about this. I don't know. I've never got the point of actually making a thing that, like, is too heavy. So I don't really know what it does. I'm kind of curious about it, though. Build ourselves a road. And then let's get ourselves that mining facility right there. Apparently I'm missing something. Uh, you can also, like, if you can't get things straight out, you can hit T and it sort of fixes it for you. I'm missing those, uh, those, those, those things. How do I make those? Do you make those things? You don't. You make... Oh, you can also make this stuff. Uh, who makes the, um... The funny guys? Well, you don't make them. Who makes those, um... Where's that at? Oh, I, I can make them, right? They're right here. I need copper plates. Okay. I can do that. And then, uh, I'll make... Is that just make two of those? I only need two, though, right? So mining facility, and there we go. Like that. Now, this doesn't do anything by itself. 
Uh, I need the power. Let me get that real quick. Um, um, actually, I think before I get power, so you notice, notice this doesn't. Normally, they have like a like a yellow or blue thing where you connect the stuff up. This one doesn't have it because it needs a module, uh, which is a where's it at? A, a a utility connector, and this thing has to go like on the lower level. It can't go on the road though. It just has to go somewhere in this little area in here. That's where your stuff's gonna connect. So I guess I'm gonna stash it like right. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Like, like it can't go up here. Can't go on top or anywhere. It has to go on the side somewhere. So I guess I'm just gonna stick it right. I don't know where to put it. I wish I could go. Oh, oh there's a little gap right there. Perfect. Let me, let me get on here. I want to go right. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it. You can do it. Uh, there's a ways of, of manipulating this a little better, but I don't know how to do it very well. Uh, we should be up there. I can't see. Uh, like there's a little hole right there. Go right there. Come on. Oh, up. Uh, let's see. I can do a light. Oh, there it is. Click. Why did you, why did you click? I clicked on you. I had you. Uh, I think we hit, we hit F. And we can go, like, floor? No. Yeah. There we go. Okay, got it. Whew, I'm worn out. Okay, now that has unlocked the ability to get power to this thing. That's where the power goes. I don't know why it doesn't come with one. It's just the game just wants to make my make, make get me all worn out. So like that, we'll connect it all up. We've got power now going to the mining man. Now the mining man needs to go and get some more modules, which would be like a mining drill or wood collector. So we're gonna go and make sure we get ourselves a mining drill. Which can go like that. He can sit right there on top. Uh, we can put one on top of him if we want. You know, two mining drills. Why not? And I'm going to go dig into this Deficinium stuff and grab me some iron, which is going to go over here. And he's going to pick it up. Just like that. Like he's already doing. Um, also, I might as well go ahead and grab some iron ore since it's right here. So let's stick one of these guys here. I can have up to six of these things. And three logistics, whichever that, whatever that is. So I want to get a mining drill over here also, and I'm going to set it... Can I put it like... Oh, it has to be one over. You can see the, the range of this thing. So it can't go too far. But it's got a little bit of a range on it. I put it there so I can get both these rocks. I guess I can get this tree over here too, can I? Is that, is that count as a... It's not a forest. So I don't think it's going to work like I want. I guess we'll find out. Um, I want a... Um, where's that stuff at? Oh, I got to click on this guy, don't I? Click on him. Wood collector, can it go here? It can go over here once I get it going, but it can't go. It can't go there. Uh, and there's no other trees around. So, all right, we'll just have to build another one over here for some for some of that, and that will give us saplings and wood. Uh, yeah, saplings and wood over there. Those are just like decorative trees. So let's get. I do want one over over this way. So let me get a uh, um, a mining drill and set it up here somehow. I think it has to be. Can I go up there? Oh, it's not quite close enough. But I can put a, uh, a foundation thing in, I think. Can I just do, like, um... Oh, that's not quite right. Yeah, like... Not like that. Not there, not there, not there. I, I know, I know. Um, like that, and just stick it on top. I might need a foundation. It says no. I can put it... Oh, it's gotta be one over this way, over there. So, let's go and put in... Like, what about floating land? Yeah, what about that? And then I can put it in. What? Why not? Oh, I'm out... Oh, because I'm out of... The whole problem is I'm out of gears. Alright, alright. So, uh, where's, uh, where's the gear guy? Um... You don't make them. You can make some pallets, though, if I had some wood. Uh, yeah, we'll get there. Let's see here. Not you. It's my assembler guy, right? Um, I forget where the, um... There, you're there. You're over there. This is him, right? If he doesn't make them, though, he just makes those. Who makes that stuff? Assembler, no. Um, I probably need to research it. Yeah, I betcha. So, let's go and get a research place done. 
research lab. So he's he's kind of cool. Uh, we'll squeeze him in. Can I put him on top of here? That'd be really cool. Let's go stick him right there. I think it's probably a good spot for him. So fill in that little gap with a, uh, a foundation. And then a uh, another foundation. Like that. And then research lab goes on top. Which I'm missing a few things. So let's go and get... Uh, I need one of those. I need more copper plates. I need some of that stuff. Oh, hey, there they are. I can make them myself. I always, always I can make them myself. I'll tell you what. All right, now back over here, mining drill. Now what? Yeah, you can go there, and I'll put you on top. Can I put you on the side over here now? I can. There we go. There's some iron. All right, so now I want to make sure I set you up before I leave. Is set you up your, your uh, transport, which is going to move that stuff out. It's all going to go into the main place, uh, which will uh, which which will go here, and then it'll get distributed wherever it needs to go. So now we've got iron, we've got uh, we got stone, and we've got coal coming in. And I've got all the network set up, so it should be going to the power guy and uh, and elsewhere. Power is a little on the low side. Which uh, are you slacking over here, sir? Make sure you're using using that 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 stuff right. And you are you are loading. Coal? Correct? Yeah, bring bring coal in. Not sure if he's really listening to me, but hopefully he is. There's no coal here yet. So that might be the Oh, there he is right there. Hmm. Hopefully he figures this thing out. He seems to be a little confused. Um Him. Sixteen coal. I think I think it's working. That wasn't there before. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now he's got it figured out. Good job, buddy. Good job. I knew you could do it. All right, now let's go get a uh, a wood place done. I think it's probably the next thing on the list. Um, okay, make more copper. Let me go dig out copper real quick. Uh, what's this? Oh, we're short three people, so we need to get more um, more workers. So uh, before we do the wood, let me go deal with that. So um, I can get a iron materials, which allows me to make the the ability to build this in an assembly line. Like I've been doing here, a uh, uh, but just added the list to make those wheels. I can get a manufacturing plant, which allows me to make, or it's just a um, oh, it's just another upgrade of the assembler, which gives me gives me that guy. Um, we can stone processing will give us a hard mining drill. Um, it also it's not appealing, bad appealing. Also gives us some pollution, which we've got a yellow thing in in pollution now, which we can deal out in a second. Uh, this one will give me a uh, an apartment unlock, a new building. For my housing, or we can do a worker housing. This is there's two different kinds of people. Worker, which is what I'm short on, right? Yeah. Uh, it's it's a modular worker house which goes onto my other house. This is what I want to show, so we're gonna do this one. So let's get that thing done. Uh, uh oh, right, my uh, man, man. Okay. <laughs> one second. Research lab. What are you missing? Oh yeah, that thing. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I need copper. I'm getting sidetracked. We're gonna go copper. Where's the copper? At? There it is. Bring in some copper. Make some copper plates. Let's make uh, some of these guys. I need ten of these things. Okay. Make me a couple of those. All right. And then, and then we'll build ourselves a research lab right there. Uh, do you need anything, research lab? You need power and water. All right. Power goes over there, uh, and water goes over there. Okay, he should be all good, right? Yeah, he's happy. Okay, now he is going to he need to make he can make these weak science things or these stone cloaks is what he does. Uh, I'm gonna set him on just auto trans auto do your thing uh, so that you can get some research started up. And I think I need one weak science. Can I? I just gotta tell you to do it, right? Produce one of those. I mean, do it. I'm not sure. Do that one too. Why not? So as I get delivered over there, he will start doing it. He, uh, there he goes. So then he will start grabbing things from over there also. And then we get research, which allows us to get bigger houses. What's going on over here? Research labs inefficient. Eh, get there, calm down. Um, let me go get some more wood. Brought in. A bit more iron in case, oh, we, we have enough iron. I need to get things I'm not mining out yet, which is like the, uh, Copper. Uh, mostly wood. So the next factory is going to have to go 
I could do one over here because that's double trees. We could just go all in on the wood. There's also a bit of, of iron over this way. It does have limited numbers of it. Oh, this one's actually a little below. How am I going to get... I'll have to figure out how to do that one. Let's, um... While we're waiting for this, let's get that... Bring these things in just to get them in here. Um, let me get a road. Just continue this guy over. And I'll put, like, a factory right... Like, right over here would be a good spot for it. I want a road to go like that. We'll continue our power lines and stuff. Basically, roads are just for power and water lines. Um, I'm going to put in a, um, a mine right here. Put some foundation on it. And a, uh, a mining facility it is right there. Same thing as before. He's going to need all this stuff like a, uh, um, a utility connector. Which is going to go right down here, I think. And then we'll connect him on up. Power cable. Uh, to him. There we go. Okay, so you got power. Uh, he is going to get a wood collector. And you're going to pop one, right? We can do a couple of these guys. And I think I think they're fine as long as they're just sort of in the area. You're bringing in wood and, sa and saplings. I think it's done. I think it's it. Yeah, he's doing it. He's taking the power from this guy, wireless power, and and shooting it over into this guy, which is then getting transported away now into the main place. So we got wood coming in. We've got a... Um, are you... Uh, which one might be simpler? Not this guy. I don't know where this guy is. I'm lost. Um, so you can also add... I should add these wood things onto there also. So get those things going, add the transport in so you can carry those things over and start making those... I think it's a pallet. Clearly a pallet. Taking raw wood, making a pallet out of it. Okay. Now. Next. Worker. Get it. Uh, yeah. Are we getting it? I don't know if we're getting it or not. Um, let me see if this guy's doing his job. He's a little short on... Oh, he isn't... Uh, what are you trying to do? You're taking, you're taking stone and you're making water, making those cloaks. You take those cloaks to make the weird, the weak science. You're not transporting those cloaks away, are you? No. Okay. Seems to be missing the wood, which I think, since I've got this set up now, doing its thing, it should be happening a little better. Uh, what I could do is speed this up a little bit, because I've got some of that in my pocket. i got to... Uh, uh, yeah, I got some of it. A lot in my pocket. I'll just toss this into here. And that'll get him moving along a little bit better. Any of these things that, that uh, I'm not making. Uh, that I'm stealing. Okay, all that stuff can go in there. And uh, some of these guys can go in there. Uh, a lot of dirt. There we go. Uh, yeah, these guys. Just fill this guy up. Why not? Why not? I'm 42 people short? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, one thing I kind of skipped before. I do have an upgrade that I can do. Uh, so, my corporation. Can I name it? No. So, we're putting points into, like, these things that we saw at the beginning of the game. Do we want to go into... I mean, we got one point, three points to spend. So, like, um... Sure, pop space. Yeah. Uh, assembly specialized. More pollution? Sure, it's fine. Building cost reduction? Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know. Oh, it costs three points for that one. Three, two points for those. All right. So there we go. Uh, pollution is, is a problem, so let's go deal with that. Take these trees, and on some buildings, you can put trees on them. For instance, I can put them on top of my research lab. And trees, uh, really that's what they do. I think they're all about looking pretty and, uh, and reducing pollution, which we should see numbers here. Pollution is at 55%. I'm 55% contaminated. That seems a little high. Um, it should adjust a bit as I add more of these trees in. We'll see about that. All right, how's this thing going? Is it going along? Oh, it's finally going along. Okay, so we're getting there. We got a few. We got. We have to do this weak science ten times for twelve seconds, and we get, we'll unlock this spot, which will allow us to build onto our house, which is a very cool thing. Which is the whole reason I'm playing this game because it's a very fancy build up, build down, build around, whatever you want to do with it, kind of thing. And I find it fascinating, and um, 
I want to show it off. This isn't even the house I'm pointing at. What am I doing? This thing. So we can probably upgrade uh, or do this one. Can I give you... Yeah, I'll give you a trash dispenser. Sure. A little more electricity, but I get a little more money out of it. Or no, maybe it cost me money. Gives a chance of getting extra credits from junk. No, I get money. So population will great. Weight rate will grow. More taxes. More storage slots. I'll also give them a canteen. Because I got the stuff for it. Sure. Have that. That makes them happy. And there is 23 people living here. 48 is possible. Uh, I guess I can double up the rice. Like, you know what? You want some rice? I got rice for you. Uh, and why don't you double up your rice? Because I got three spots here. So we'll make a third rice farm thing. Just make sure I got food. Because I don't see anywhere in here that says... It doesn't say people are starving. So I'm going to assume everyone's fine. I got 75 cans of rice already there. Canned rice. Mm. Okay, so once we get these modules, though, we'll get to add on to our house and make it... Uh, we'll build up. We can build down. We can do whatever we want with it uh, on this thing. And that's slowly coming in. Power and water is under control now. So that's good. It's all just being yanked... The coal getting yanked out of here, going into this spot, and then getting pulled over into the uh, the, the factory. It's a whole chain of things. But it's, it's, uh, it's actually not, like... It's not overwhelming. Maybe it gets that way once you start getting into the more techs. But right now, it's pretty, you know, not a whole lot to it. This game's been around for a while, uh, or in development for a while. I remember playing this, uh, it was either last year or the year before, for my free games month here. And there was no tutorial back then. I was completely lost. So I didn't, I didn't play it. But I noticed this year around that there is now a tutorial. Um, and, it, you know, it, it, it does its job. It covers the basics. I think we've got everything done. Uh, that's all done. Um, yeah, yeah. We've hit uh, research is the last thing. There we go. So that's the tutorial I just did there, basically. Uh, we're waiting for this thing to get done here, and we'll add on to our house, and it will be set. Um, I probably have... Let me see about this. So you could probably upgrade, actually, um, eventually. If I get you more space or something, we'll learn some new stuff. Uh, there we go. New tech is here. Let's go and learn with this. Hey, there we go. A tool warehouse. Extra warehouse slots. Uh, foundation capacity. Dead body storage. What? <laughs> well, that's not really what I was going for, but... I mean, I guess it's important. Just just toss them. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, anyway, uh, I have a house. This house needs a worker... M modular worker house, I say. So let's make one. Uh, Tam? Uh, yeah, that one. So, this guy, it takes some wood, takes some pallets, and takes some steel. It has to go on a house. It can go anywhere. It can go up here. Uh, it can go... I think it can go down here? Um, I lied. It can't go down below. But it can go up top. And... Like, we can have it, like, hang out a little bit. Like, it can hang up over the, over the farm. That's fancy. Can we go over the road? <gasps> we can. Okay, okay. Um, yes. I'll put one over there. How many can it have? Um, is there a limit? There's got to be a limit. I don't know what it is. It has three current modules. I don't know how many. what the limit is, though. So I'm going to... We're using it. We'll have to put one over here. We'll stick one... Oh, oh maybe I'm at my limit. It seems to be yelling at me, so maybe we're at the limit. Okay. Oh, yeah. Ooh. It looks different. Why does it look different? Why are you so different? What's so special about you? Did I do something special? Make you look a little cooler? That's neat. Okay. Okay. Um, and so this is all connected with the... Uh, check that out. Uh, it's all connected. W the, as long as the ground level is getting the water, resources, all that, it's fine. So three level zero houses, and I have one level one house. I don't know why, but I accept. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with that, but that's cool. Uh, and we can come in here, we can put trees on top. Let's put some trees. Let's do them like right... Oh, can I put them right there? But I want to put them right there. So they can go... Um, I want them to go right there, though. Okay, fine. We'll, we'll make a level here of trees. There we go. Let's deal with that pollution problem we've got. We can put trees over here, too. You take trees? No, no. Um, oh, 
You take trees. Okay. Oh, that's not even a building. <laughs> All right. So there we go. That's a little nicer. A little green stuff hanging off the edge on top of our uh, our fancy. I bet you there's got to be. Build build tree next to this building to increase production speed. Oh, okay. I get a bonus tax gain for this, but it doesn't say why. It's got to say why somewhere. Because it's near a factory, I get a plus nine population size. There's an indoor park apparently. Is oh, it's a research. I can can I do that one? I get that. I can unlock. I can unlock that one thing. Um. Like fly, flies around here. What's the with the buzz? So there's like little uh, things. I don't see what it is here. It doesn't tell me here. Uh, that 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 synergies, synergies. That's 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 the thing. So and I don't know them all. Then there, there is no mention of them anywhere. Maybe there is, but I just haven't found them. So this guy's um, what he's producing over there. No boost there. What about you? Nothing over there. Yeah. So anyway, there's there's that. What am I working on? I'm working on that, that storage thing. So there's a fancy, fancy house. Uh, I'm short 34 people, though. This house can now hold, have 80 people in it. So uh, we're just waiting for people to come in here, really. That's all we can do. Um, if I can find... I think it was a farming tech was in here somewhere. Yeah, that one. We start getting different foods. Right now we're just bringing rice in, and that's it. We start going up from there, and, uh, and we can see my city stats. How's pollution looking? It doesn't seem. Did it go down or up? Contaminated is going up. That seems like a bad thing. Maybe I can put some trees in over here. No, it's going. They go on top. Or I can put in some. Ooh, ooh. Why? Why did you? Why did you do that? Because there's a number of people in here or something. Maybe because they're happy. Tell me why. So I have four houses. I, there's no modules on here, apparently. I guess I can get more modules, maybe. Let's attack on. Yeah, because I can't put anything else, anything else in here. This has all been upgraded as much as we can. Transport's been set up. It's bringing all the rice in. And am I just because they're happy and because there's a lot of people here? Um, there's a condition happy. We've, we've got more than 20 people. We've got... Uh, a distanced item consumption of the rice. It has water and electricity, and it has one additional service, which I don't know what that is. There's 53 space available. And we've got more space from consumption from the rice, I guess. 10 space from aura. I guess happiness? And then in, uh, in my bonus for the mul multiplicative pop space. That's a word I didn't think I'd be saying today. Okay, uh, I gotta put a, I, I gotta, I gotta end it here. This has been a long video, but uh, I think I, I, I think, see what's going on here. The, the, the ideas are, are all there. Uh, there's our mast, which you can see. We need to eventually get, I guess, there's a tech for getting uh, the spinny bits to keep us afloat. I don't know where that is. I haven't got to that point yet. But uh, you can see there's a lot, a lot more things here, and this is just a little free. Uh, a, I mean, it's in development, a free thing though on itch.io. So, uh, a proper fit to Free Games Month here on the channel. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any other ideas for more free games, feel free to join the Discord and post away because um, I will take uh, whatever you got. Anyway, let's call it a day, and I will see you next time.